Hi, I'm Finn Peacock. Here's a sticky question. What's the difference between the three major solar panel technologies? That is monocrystalline, multi-crystalline or polycrystalline, same thing, and uh, the wildcard thin film solar. Let's start with monocrystalline and multicrystalline. It's an easy answer. There's no difference. Um, I say that because I get emails all the time. Oh, this solar, solar sales guy that sells monocrystalline solar panels, he tells me that multi-crystalline solar panels are crap. And I hear exactly the opposite from the guys that sell multi-crystalline solar panels. They say, oh, this is better for Aussie conditions, that's better for Aussie conditions. Pure bullshit. Uh, 10 years ago, it might have been true. Um, I won't go into details, but solar panel technologies come on, a good monocrystalline solar panel and a good multi-crystalline solar panel to all practical purposes perform identically. Um, don't get hung up over mono or multi, um, mono or poly. Don't just get a good solar panel, okay? Where there is a difference between solar panel technologies is thin film solar. Um, thin film solar is a completely different way of making solar panels. Um, I'm not a big fan of them, I've got to say. Um, for a start, they're half the efficiency which means that they take up twice as much space on your roof. So you need a huge roof to get any si kind of decent sized solar system. Um, one of the advantages that people claim for them is that they're shade tolerant. That winds me up. <laughs> there is no such thing as a shade tolerant solar panel. If you have a solar panel and it's in shade, I don't care what technology it is, you ain't gonna get any electricity because there's no sun shining on it. What they're trying to get at is it's more tolerant to partial shade. So if you cover 40% of a thin film solar panel with shade, you'll get a proportional power hit. So you'll lose 40% of your power. If you cover 40% of a monocrystalline or polycrystalline solar panel with shade, you'll probably lose almost all the power of that solar panel. But you've got to ask yourself, why are you installing a solar panel in a area that gets so much shade anyway. That's insane. You're gonna take a massive hit to your power. So yes, thin film solar panels are more tolerant to partial shade, but I still think they're a waste of time. <laughs> and I get into trouble for saying that, but stick with mono, stick with multi. If you want to read uh, my other thoughts on thin film solar panels and the problems with them, there's a blog post I wrote. Um, go read it, um, where I give them a really good bagging. But, in terms of the difference between the main technologies, monocrystalline, multicrystalline, there's no difference. Go for it.